Hey everyone, welcome back. So today I'm really excited to show you this Style Pro Makeup Brush Cleaner. Now this isn't a sponsored ad or anything like that. I purchased this with my own money, but I absolutely love it and I wanted to show you guys. So what's great about this is it's proven to hygienically clean and dry brushes in seconds, which is a revelation if you're a makeup artist. I've seen a few of these different types of makeup brush cleaners in the past, but none as quick as this, and that is why I'm absolutely fascinated and in love with this product. It was my twin sister who showed me, she bought it first and I had to copy and get one for myself. So in the box you get the Style Pro handle. This uses the centrifugal spin technology so it spins super super fast and that's what's going to dry your brushes. It has a little on off switch and it also has a little torch light on it. And as you can see it also comes with the bowl which I'll explain a little bit more about in a minute. I've purchased a few bottles of the Style Pro makeup brush cleaner and conditioner. This has been specifically designed to remove non-water soluble makeup, so it will remove any thick oil based products such as certain foundations, lipsticks etc. And you can use it both with synthetic and natural brush hairs. The bowl is made out of glass which is more hygienic because the makeup isn't going to stick to it like it would if it was made out of plastic. It also comes with a silicone rim seal. We've then also got 8 silicone collars for your brushes, as well as 2 attachments for the different sizes. And it also comes on a nice neat collar stand. So let's get on with how to use it. You're going to take your brush and just slip it into the collars till you find one that makes it a little bit more difficult to slip into so you know it's not going to fall off of the silicone collar. Once it's a nice snug fit you should be able to hold the end of the collar and the brush won't tilt. I'm going to take the black attachment and slip that into the end of the sleeve. This one is for all of the silicone collars barring the two largest ones. Then we want to insert that into the Style Pro handle until it clicks and then you're ready to go. As we are removing a liquid foundation from the bristles and it is an oil based foundation we're going to be using one cap of the Style Pro Makeup Cleaner and then apply the silicone splash guard. Just to show you what the Style Pro is going to do, when you switch it on the brush handle is going to spin so fast that it's going to splay the bristles out. So we're going to dunk the brush into the solution a few times making sure that we don't dip it past the metal ferrule which is the silver part. Then you want to turn the handle on and start dunking the brush up and down into the solution while it's spinning. And you want to do this for 10 seconds. Then you want to lift your brush out of the solution while it's spinning but keeping it below the splash guard and again leave it spinning for 10 seconds and that is going to completely dry the bristles. It's been clinically proven that spinning the bristles this fast is forcing the bacteria and the dirt and the water out of the brush. And as you can see, it looks brand new again. It literally takes 20 seconds. Now for makeup that is water soluble, you can use an antibacterial hand soap or you can use baby shampoo. So in the bowl I've got clean water and I'm using one pump of the antibacterial hand soap. And to show you that you can practically clean any brush shape, I'm going to clean my mini kabuki which I use on a daily basis with my Bare Minerals. For this one I need the second biggest sleeve, so this requires the white attachment to slip into the collar and the handle. I'm going to show you two viewpoints here so you can see the brush on the side. Start by dunking the brush and then you want to spin it in the solution for 10 seconds. Remember to bounce the brush up and down into the solution so that all the water gets right into the bristles and right into the centre of the brush. Then you want to lift your brush out of the solution but below the splash guard still and leave that to spin for 10 seconds while it forces all of that bacteria and dirt and water out of the bristles. And again this is completely dry and ready to use. Ordinarily this would take 24 hours to dry in an airing cupboard. And just to prove to you that it is completely dry, I'm dabbing it onto some tissue just to show you there's no residue, dampness or dirt. It's completely clean and dry. So I really hope that's going to be useful for any makeup artists or those of you that have tons of makeup brushes. I'll leave a link to the website in the description bar below. So as usual, please subscribe if you haven't already done so. If you've missed my previous tutorials, you can click on these now. Don't forget you can follow me on Facebook, Twitter and Instagram. They are all at Show Me Makeup. And thank you for watching and I'll see you in my next video. Bye!